Hey everybody, this is Jim Anthony and this is a CBT Micro Nugget on the Salesforce homepage. Just going to take a couple of minutes to show you some of the cool things you can and maybe should be doing with the homepage and the cool information that you might want to have there, right there at your fingertips. Well, first of all, let's just talk about what the home page is. This is your home base, you know. You start out in Salesforce on the home page, and what you want to do is create a page that makes sense for you. So you want to set this page up and customize this page to contain the information that's going to help you start your day or get a quick snapshot of how things are going. Um, or whatever information you need to feel organized. So some of the standard components that you're going to see on a home page, first and foremost, is a dashboard. And you can customize the pieces and parts of this dashboard. Now this particular dashboard shows sales. You know, it shows closed sales today, so you can kind of see how you're doing for the month or the quarter or however you set that up. And then it shows marketing, it shows leads by lead source. So if you're looking at the overall business and you want to get a sense of where the business is coming from, or at least where the leads are coming from, you know, you got the key down here, top five open deals that you're working on. You know, those are good things to keep your eyes on. You know, if you had a whiteboard in your office, these are the kinds of things you might write up on your whiteboard to keep in front of you to keep reminding yourself this is where I stand so we're using the dashboard on the home page for that and it's a great tool and then when you come down the page a little bit we have as a pretty standard standard component on the home page my tasks and the calendar so if you have calls scheduled that need to be made or follow-up items that, that, that need to happen, you're probably going to see them listed here. You will have created those in a contact or in an account or within an opportunity. They're going to show up here right on your home page. And then uh, calendar items. You know, If you've got things to do that are on your calendar, they're going to show up right here. And uh, you're even able to uh, create new events if you want to or set up new meetings. We'll take a look at that in a moment. But that's what the home page is. It's the place to start, the place to organize the, 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 the up-to-the-minute information on what's going on in your world. One of the first things I want to show you is right now the chatter feed is hidden on the, on the home page. So if you click on the show feed button, you're going to see all of the updates from the people that you are following. Uh, or if you're following accounts, contacts, opportunities, whatever activity is going on, it's going to show up in this feed right here on your home page. And of course, right here from the home page, you can click in this box and you can type in an update as well and post it for everybody to see. So the chatter feed uh, is right there in the center of your home page and then if you don't want the chatter feed and you just want to fo focus on you know the tasks and the calendar items and things that you need to get done you can just click here and hide that feed and of course don't forget that you do have a whole you know you have a whole chatter tab up here you can go to if you want to dive in to see what's going on actively with the communication and the collaboration so here's one of the great things you can do from the home page. Click on show feed and let's just say you know you were working with your HR director on some things and you just want to find out what the latest is. Maybe you've been out, out of the office for a full day or so. So you would click down here on the uh, magnifying glass for a search and I'm going to type in her name, the HR director, and just hit enter. And what you're going to see here is just the information that applies to her. now. This person, the VP of uh, Sales, copied Yuko on this particular note here. But most of what you're going to see are items that Yuko had put into the uh, into Chatter. So we'll go down here a little bit, but you'll see there's Yuko there, and then here, and then here. So very quickly, I can get up to speed on the interactions with my HR director to find out. Sorry, that's jumping around there. I should use the bar here to scroll that's that's much nicer um, so I can connect with Yuko here to find out what's going on with her and you know what she needs and just read her last few messages and get right back to her so it's very quick and easy to be able to do a search here so let's go ahead and just close the social feed here the chatter feed and go on down so the other big thing you can do from the home page then is just you can create and view and edit uh, you know your tasks and your calendar entries so let's 
hit this new button here and go ahead and add a task. Uh, maybe it's a, a you know a phone call, and let's just say it's you know due tomorrow. Put the third there. Call John regarding deal. And then I would select related to a specific opportunity. I would look up the particular opportunity. We're going to go ahead and stick that in there. And we're going to put it right on this American Bank opportunity. And then we're going to associate this particular task with a particular name. Let's look up a name. We'll go there. And who do we have here? John Amos. Okay, so bottom line is very quickly from the home page, you're able to click on a new task, put in whatever it is, associate, associate it with an opportunity or with a contact or both, put in a couple of comments, and then we'll come on down here. You may want to add some additional information such as uh, in progress. I'm going to call it a normal priority. I'm going to go ahead and click send notification email because I like getting emails when things happen so go ahead and make that the default setting and then uh, save for 8 a.m. tomorrow and never ever forget to click save we'll put that in there and now back at the home page um, I'm gonna refresh the page and then I'm gonna come over here and say I want the next seven days of activities so when I put the next seven days of activities on my home page I'm going to see all the tasks, the phone calls, and things that I've put into Salesforce as, as actions or tasks now are going to show up on my home page. So it's great to have that kind of information right there on the first page you look at. We can, you know, come down here and click on new event. You can do the same thing for calendar. So your calendar events, your phone calls, tasks, all those things can be created right here from the home page and then they show up on the home page to keep you informed as to what's going on. Well, I appreciate the chance to put this together. I hope it's been informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing.